The Easton Red Rovers on the road still unbeaten after a strong start to this season, having scored no less than eight runs in each of their five wins. Audrey Rinda started on the mound in search of a sixth straight win for the group, while Adeline Smith started on the rubber for the hosting Hurricanes. Easton would be the first on the board with Ella Schwartz knocking in Alyssa Mayorka with a sack fly to right field and would hold the Hurricanes scoreless in the bottom of the inning. But Liberty would get things going with two outs in the bottom of the second, scoring Adriana O'Neill on a wild pitch and loading the bases before Ariana Castillo clears them with the spinning grounder back to Rinda. She would come around to score before the Red Rovers secured a third out for the 5-1 to one lead. And it would stay that way until the fifth inning with Adeline Smith getting a hold of one and launching it over the left field fence, creating a spark for what would be a six-run inning for the home team. And McKenna Beck would drive in two more runs, waiting on it and sending it deep to left to bring around a Loriana Quayley and Castillo to make it 12 to 1 going into the bottom of the fifth. The Red Rovers would load the bases in the bottom of the inning and Katie Walsh would empty them later coming around to score to make it 12 to 5. Anna Jones would make it 12 6 with a homer in the sixth but that would be all Easton could muster as Liberty tacks on one more run and Smith records her eighth and final strikeout to close it out for the 13 to 6 win. I think everyone on the team played a big part of it. I mean, our pitcher Addie did great. Our bats really came alive and the infield was strong. I mean, we knew it was going to be a tough game, but the win really, it felt nice. I think everyone just got their energy up, and after they saw one person hit, we just built off of it, and it just carried on over and over again. It gets stressful, of course, but I just got to know that my teammates have my back even when I make errors and just know that like we're going to come in and we're going to hit even more. With tonight's win, the Hurricanes handed Easton its first loss and held the team to its lowest scoring performance of the season thus far, and they did it by capitalizing on every opportunity in their breakthrough second inning and applying continuous pressure until they secured the win. We attacked and attacked and attacked, and we just kept every time we had uh, anyone on base, we moved them. We, we advanced runners. We got pretty key hits today uh, when we needed them, which, which was a big thing. But they're a great team. You cannot, I don't care, 12 to 1 at one point it was, you can't stop on that team because they, they just know how to come back and, and fight. So we just kept going. I was, I was very proud of our girls. At Liberty High School, I'm Sierra Jones for the Service Electric Network.